Hey everybody, welcome back to Planet Coaster, the name for this giant squiggly mess we made the past couple episodes is now Whiplash, we think it's safe. Wait, 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 wait. Whiplash, we think it's safe. Isn't there another one with a very similar name? Hold on a second. I gotta look at my rides list. Um, they were also yelling at me that all my rides were broken down, but it looks like only one of them is broken down. So nice try, game. Hold on. Don't worry, it should be safe. Very similar to, we think it's safe. Why? It's like, almost like you guys don't have faith in my coasters. Or something. I don't... Okay, anyway. I made it not suck. Look at that. 6.3. I mean, it's not the greatest, but at least we fixed that G problem. The G-force problem, which was right here. Like I said, it was just right there. So what I did was I lowered the speed of this. And then I put a booster up here. And then I also had to change this a little bit, because... Why did I change it? I had to make room for the booster, that's why. So I added that, I moved this over, and then I had to change this whole piece of track. But it seems like it's all good now. I might need to move that path up a little bit more. Also... Look at here! Duration, 96 seconds. Previously, the longest coaster was this Giga Coaster that we made. And it's sitting at a 88.4. Also, this might be the most exciting ride in the park. 6.7. Wait, maybe not. 6.3. It's so weird. you think it would be higher. I guess there's not enough hills. I don't know. But we gotta pass the thing up. We gotta add more flat rides. We gotta, we gotta do a lot. So, here goes nothing. I might be able to get a flat ride right here. Maybe the swinging ship. There's no way. I don't even know why I even said it. It's not gonna happen. That was stupid of me. Alright, entrance. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Before I do that... Oh, uh, never mind. I got rid of the block brakes. The ride actually stopped. The block brakes caused it to stop and not go on. And uh, I had the wrong station selected for that, but it's fine. No one's going to come up here to ride this thing anyway, so... <laughs> Don't worry. It's not like... Uh... Oh, I probably should put the entrance first. Or exit first. I did put the entrance first. That should be fine. It's not like we're going to need to worry about... Um, whatever I was saying. Oh, yeah, a lot of people riding it. Paths! Let's go. There, there, and then this shouldn't be that painful. A straight shot right to there. Awesome. I like when things aren't difficult. <laughs> Especially this high up in the park. We can go this way with it. I'm gonna do a little bit of turn. I'm gonna do this way with it. And honestly, that's probably perfect. Good. The ride is open. The biggest coaster, the longest coaster, it actually is giant compared to uh, the noodler or whatever we called it. No floors, no worries. Was the uh, it seemed like the biggest one, longest one. I mean, I'm not counting the gig coaster because we put that on the very outside of the park and we built around it somehow. How did we manage that? Stations down here, the ride goes all the way up here, and then just that was that was a journey. And I even put a coaster in the middle of it. Jeez, what's wrong with me? But this. Then we had the, the no floors, no worries. And then there's just this ball of track. It's beautiful. All right, let's get a new track ride over here. Track ride. Flat ride. Oh, boy. This is the fun part, trying to pick which one I want. Ooh, we don't have a uh, top spin. And we probably won't ever have a top spin because it's probably too big. It doesn't look too big. This looks actually perfect. Hold on a second. Hold the friggin' phone. Uh-oh, it's gonna be too big. Never mind, we don't have as much room here as I thought. I think that's what it boils down to. Big ol' yikes. Yeah, we might not be able to get any ride in here. Now that I see how much room we have, I don't think it's gonna work. The smallest ride, alright, let's just look at the smallest ride, which is this carousel. And if this fits in, then there might be chance, but if this doesn't even fit in, then there's no chance. Wow, this thing is so small. We could put, like, these things everywhere in the park. Oh, did not want to do that. Everywhere where there's not a ride, I'm just going to put a Venetian carousel in. <laughs> Done. Easy. I don't know if we're going to be able to get anything in here. Uh, oh, we don't have a whirly rig. Perfect. Okay, we're putting this thing in. We this is every park needs one of these. 
It's pretty much an essential. An octopus Ferris wheel for kids. Perfect. I don't know how I'm going to path this up yet. Um, hmm. It's the best way to go about... I could cram it in the corner here. Lower it as much as possible. And that way you get, like, food. And maybe I'll put food up here. We still need to put food somewhere. The last food places all the way down here are the restaurant, if you can count that. So it's quite a journey up here. We might put some, like not like an actual food place, but some food stalls over here I think would be smart. So I don't complain. Also a bathroom maybe, because we haven't put one of those in in a while. Oh wait, are we going through the, oh yeah, we definitely are. Let's put that over there as much as possible. Perfect! The octopus ferris wheel is in. Boop. We'll put the entrance somewhere. We'll put the exit right there. Wow, people have made it up. Welcome. <laughs> Welcome to the new area of the park. Paths. Actually, better yet. I'm going to do it like that so I can attach the entrance down here. Good. And then the queue line. It's weird that everything's like... I don't know why I say that. I was about to say working. And then came the queue line. Don't know why I make the queue line this big. No one's going to ride it. There we go. Okay. Octopus ride. Open. Easy. I got to change prices. I keep on forgetting that that's a thing that needs to happen. Oh, maybe we do have a bunch of rides that get broken down. How many mechanics do I have? I honestly don't even know. $12 for that ride. How about free? Make that free as well. Good. Whoa, look at that prestige. I think it's because it's new. Old, reviving, reviving. Established. Established. So, Mini Spaghetti should be the first one that hits old timer status or classic or whatever it is. Because, wow, even that's better than the thing I just made. Why is the thing I just made so bad? Lifetime profit. Wow, that's a lot of money. Even though, well, now we're not charging anything, so. One year, six months. It takes forever. All right, back up we go. I also think I fixed my scroll speed. I just made it negative 10, which is the slowest you can make it. And it's not sending me across the map anymore, so. I'd say that's a win. So, food and drink. Let's see here. Um, shops or somewhere. There they are. Vending machines. So loud. What the hell of any machines that? Custom, there we go. Right, there is no separate thing for them. One of these days I'll remember that. This is not that thing. Make it as long as possible. So there can be a line. Chief! Beef! And of course, some milk. Nothing like a hamburger. And a nice cold milk. Ugh. So it's like you eat the cow and you drink its... You drink the drink the cow's milk that you're eating. It's perfect. That's what we do. We milk the cows dry and then put them in a vending machine for you to eat. This is the greatest song in the game. So good! Nothing screams octopus ferris wheel like, okay, there's a lot of people coming up here. Maybe I should get some benches and, no, we need garbage cans. Stat! Garbage cans, garbage cans, garbage cans, garbage cans. Garbage cans. Perfect. And I'm going to put one over here. And I'm going to put one over here. Wait, I'll put it over here. Why isn't anybody riding my octopus ferris wheel? What the hell? I'm going to put some down here as well. Because we don't have any... Try to put them on the landings. Because it's the only spot to put them around here. And two, I don't want garbage everywhere. Surprisingly, not as much garbage as I thought there would be. 
in these areas. Okay. So there's that. And now comes the fun part of trying to put them on the staircase up this way. Am I... What? No, that's easy. It's... I don't know what I'm saying anymore. Don't listen to me. I think what my brain was thinking was, okay, I gotta build part of the park up here now, and this staircase is very long and stupid, and people are gonna have to come up here. I think that's what my brain was saying, but as I was placing the garbage cans, I was trying to process that, which none of it made sense. Just don't listen to me. Okay, so this new piece of track I added is gonna cause some problems for this, so I might have to back it up a little bit, unless... Now we're fine. Okay. So we have all this area up here to do with as we see fit. And I think I'm going to put a bunch of flat rides. It'll be flat ride landing. There's going to be a bunch of them. It's going to be great. And when I say a bunch, it's probably going to be at the most two. Because <laughs> I don't think we're going to be able to fit more in. Do we have this thing? 360 power, we do not. I'm kind of losing track of the ones we have, so maybe I should start doing it in order. Uh, X. We gotta lower that. Okay, we can't put it there. We can put it here, though. Try to back it up as much as possible. I gotta watch out for the ride that we just built. Oh, wait, that's the entrance and exit over there. So we want it like this. Can I put it over the path? Probably. Easy. Bring it back there. Okay, that's as far as that'll go that way. Good. And yeah, see, we're inside the coaster, so we're gonna back up like that. And I think that's good enough. I mean, you're gonna be sideways here, so you shouldn't hit your head. Good. Entrance. Bam. Exit. Bam. What else? We can definitely fit more in here. Let's see. Rides. We have a big wheel. We don't have a blackout, a.k.a. a pirate ship that is just a spaceship. So, real original with that ride design. Um, if I rotate it, I don't know if rotating is going to work. Because it swings. Oh, apparently it will. Hold on a second. I need to see if this works, because I'm pretty sure those two are going to collide. Because this thing spins this way. Oh, I also just realized there's staircases down the backside there. Okay, so they're probably... It doesn't matter. Same with this. The staircase is both ways. So that way's the entrance. This way's the exit. This way's the entrance. That way's the exit. So technically, you know, it doesn't actually matter the orientation of it, but I tried to make it so it makes sense. But, okay, whatever. doesn't matter. Um, yeah, right there. I need to do a test on this and this at the same time to see what happens here. Oh, boy. This is gonna get a little awkward, ain't it? Uh, almost. Uh, oh, we've got a collision. Jeez, that instantly sends them right up. Yeah, so that ain't gonna work, Chief. I mean, technically it works, but... Also, you're gonna hit the path there as well. Alright, what if I rotate it the other way, though? I think if we do that, that's gonna solve all our problems. So we just do a little bit of a whoop. That's it. Oh, wait. Whoa, it comes very close to hitting that way. <laughs> I think we did it, everybody. We solved it. Also, let me just make sure. Okay, we're good here as well. Could you imagine, like, walking down these stairs and see that thing, like, swooping down at you? It'd be better if it was the other way, but I'm not going to rotate that. It's pointless. Okay, we did it. Two flat rides. Done. And then we can get our food area up here as well, because we got plenty of space. So we need some path. Oh, we also should probably put the entrance and exits on this. Entrance over there, sure. Exit right here, whatever paths and that one we might need to angle down nope did it for us good that's beautiful staircase right there okay 
I wonder if one of these is going to be the new Zozo. Remember the Zozo, everybody? Should we try to open that back up again? I'm having flashbacks to what it was like before. I don't think it's a good idea to open the Zozo. Okay, whatever, good enough. Look, it's all zigzaggy. Everyone knows the best queue lines are zigzaggy. Perfect. All right, let's open things. Boop. And boop. Okay. Well, look at this. There's actually people down here. Amazing. Oh, God. They're doing that thing where they're running into each other. Toilets. Also, is anybody riding my, my octopus ride? Oh, there are people in it. Wow. Look at that. Didn't think it would ever happen. Okay. Um, bathrooms. Because I wanted to put one down here and forgot. Good. Also, one thing I forgot to look at was my mechanics. Because I did say I want to check that. Because look at all the things that are broken down. Uh, mechanics, mechanics, mechanics. How many do we have? Happiness, training level, pay. Wow, they're all happy. Good. Um, name. I don't want name. I want profession. So we go to mechanic. We have three. <laughs> Maybe we should get a few more. One, two, three, four, five. There we go. I, they were complaining that their workload wasn't hard enough. See, look. Now it's all normal. One guy was working harder than everyone else. So good. Alright. So we're just giving them way more money than they deserve. And everything is fine. How much in how debt how much in debt were we? Monthly profit of minus forty three thousand. <laughs> Remember when Tiny Park actually used to turn a profit? And then I started making everything free and giving our employees way too much money? And now we're minus 43,000 a month. It's pretty good. <laughs> October year 13. Welcome to October year 13. All right, let's get some more food up here. And I'm going to do that by doing this. Not only food, I think I'm going to get some gift shops as well. They don't like to complain about gift shops. Although, I feel like that's changed. Ever since um, we made everything free. Oh, look at this. I can come back here as well. What am I going to put back here? I don't know. Paths, maybe? Paths? We already have a path. Benches is what I meant to say. All right, let's get a toilet. Yes, toilet. All the way down there. That's exactly where I wanted you. Okay, so the toilet's being a pain. You know what? Fine, I'll put the toilet over here. Just get rid of that path. There we go. Toilet! Come back to me. I need you. Good. Put it at the end of the path so they have to walk the whole length to get to it. That is the trick. Now we need some vending machines. As I click the wrong button, that's what I'm good at doing. So, let's put a gulpy machine in. Oh, let's do that stupid thing which is attaching that stupid building. Press shift so it stays at this height. Boop. Go B! Yeah! Go B! What else do we got? Um, uh, excelente. Sounds like something from Willy Wonka. I don't speak Spanish, so I have no idea what they just called me. Gift shops. There we go. Looney Balloons, Hats Fantastic, or just a moment. I think we're going to go Hats Fantastic because uh, I don't think we have hats. I think we just have balloons. Do we even have balloons? Hats fan. Oh, I get it. It's like that's fantastic, except it's hats. So it's like Hats Fantastic because, you know, they're fantastic hats. Eh. Wait, apparently it's the third one. Maybe we already have one of these. 
I can't remember what our gift shops are. I can look because I'm a good manager. Um, there we go. We still have three broken down rides. Fantastic. Hats, hats fantastic that we have three broken down rides right now. Small attraction shops. I just want freaking fricks. The gift shops. Okay, we do have Looney Balloons. Just a Memento. Okay, hats fantastic. I don't know. I don't know where they pull these numbers from. Just a Memento sixteen. Like, hats fantastic three. I I don't know where they get the numbers. Looney Balloons nineteen. Like, they're just completely random numbers. All right, let's make sure we pay these clowns, or else they'll get angry and leave my park. And that's just annoying to deal with. So they are vendors. There we go. Good. Enjoy sitting in that box for the rest of your life, getting paid money that you'll never use to spend on anything because you're literally stuck in that box your entire life. Get a bunch of benches. I love how I can hear that Ferris wheel. Somebody was saying that I should build a flat ride that plays music because they missed hearing music in the park. Well, guess what? You're welcome. <laughs> you get to listen to the pirate now. Pirate song over and over again. The best song. Okay, I like this area. Even though there's not a single body up here. Let's fast forward a little bit and see what happens. There they are. Multiple rides are broken down. I just hired five more mechanics and they still can't get this done? Is that what's transpiring here? Do I need to fire some people? I'll do it. I enjoy firing people. Don't test me! There's also something else I want to do. I forget what it was, though. Look at Tiny Park. Isn't Tiny Park great? It's amazing how little path there is here now that there's a giant coast. Like, I was talking about all the path like down here and stuff, but we had the yellow rides looking like path, and now it's just wide open, which is nuts. All right, how much room do we have left? That's a good thing to figure out. We got to be getting close to the top now. Like, when we were down here, I'm like, oh, there's no way. We've got so much room left. But after that coaster, I feel like we're pretty high up. Also, don't know what I'm going to do with this path, because how are we going to go that way with it? We might have to turn it, like, instantly. Yeah, we'll be fine. Okay, we got plenty of room. So, this is what we're going to do. I'm going to look at the rides, and I'm going to look at the Observation Tower, Skywatcher, because this is the one I'm putting at the very top. I think it's, like, the tallest one. It's either this one or this one, Sunflare, which is taller. All right, this is how we're going to test it. We're going to put it right here and see where it goes up to on Tiny Park. So this one goes up to around the bumper or whatever that spinny thing is and the other spinny thing. This one... Okay, yeah, this one does not go up higher. I feel like this one would be more terrifying, though. This ride in general is terrifying, because you're just, like, all the way at the top on, like, these little swingy benches, and you feel like you can just slip right out. Man, it's spooky. However, this one is taller, so this one's going to the top. Like, at least in this one, you're, like, in your confined little box, and you can't fall out. Okay. Oh, look at the underside of it. Disgusting. We need to go all the way to the top. This is how we're going to do it. We're going to do advanced. And we got to... Oh, boy. We got to find the arrow, number one. Down there. All right, up it goes. Are we in the park? We're not even in the park. Where are we having problems? No, don't tell me it can't fit in the park. I know it can fit in the park. Are we just that close to the end? There we go. There's no way. All right. Okay. We have more room than I thought. Right there. That's the top of Tiny... We are getting close. That is the tippy top of Tiny Park. Like, right there is the limit. And all that, like, the tower sticking out of the top. We can't build up here. But, like, you can build outside the area as long as the station's inside. So that is the very top of the box. And wow. Look at that. We're past the halfway mark, definitely. Probably, like, two-thirds of the way there. 
It's kind of hard to tell from this far out, but building up there is going to be a pain. I mean, building up at this level is already a pain, so. We still got a little bit of more room to go. Don't worry. There's still plenty of videos coming. And, uh, yeah. Pancake Park comes next after the after Tiny Park. It's going to be great. Anyway, I'm going to end this one here. Thank you all for watching. Leave a like, share the video if you enjoyed. That helped a lot. Subscribe if you want to see more. And I'll see you next time.